Hey, what's up guys? It's Donovan X3, and I just want to make a video about my Kodak ZI8, and uh, I just want to note a couple things here. Um, one being that I recently updated my Kodak software, to, or firmware actually, to 1.06 from 1.03. Uh, the low light situations are significantly better, and the zoom function is a lot better. The audio, the mono mic is a uh, the internal mic is a bit better now as well and uh... so if you get the chance definitely upgrade your firmware from 1.03 which is the default factory to 1.06 which is currently out on uh, january eighth alright so other things let's see software i use for editing i um... took me a bit to find some software that worked well with uh, Windows Vista, which is I'm running right now, Windows Vista Ultimate, and um, I found Movie Edit Pro 15, and I got it, I downloaded it, I bought it, um, and uh, it's working really well. So, uh, yeah, um, it's it's a bit hard, it's a bit hardware demanding on my laptop, but it's working really well for video editing from the ZI8. So, if you have the any money, check it out. Um, I bought the plus version, so um, it has support for up to full HD 1080p, um, as well as color, as well as color, uh, you know, color tinting, uh, as, you know, everything. So it's, it has many, many effects and fades as well. So I haven't checked out uh, almost any of it yet, but I will in the uh, very close future. So I just wanna. I'll tell you guys about that, and I'll have some new test videos out with the 1.06 firmware pretty soon. So, uh, Magic's Movie Edit Pro 15, check that out if you really need some software um, for the Codex ZI8 um, um, video files.